Well, Seattle PD, thank you for not towing my vehicle while I went to go get gas. Hopefully that wasn't a hard sell for you, but uh, you all really need to make sure that you all have protocol for gang stalking, subjective objective protocol. And you pretending that gang stalking does not exist only incriminates you. But uh, for all of the uh, true brethren out there, guys, you gotta know, this is a spiritual battle. And uh, anybody and everybody who is serving the light has a very special anointing in all of this to protect you and yours. But I will say this, when you're called to serve the light, it's not easy. I gave myself to uh, serve the light uh, since I was eight years old. And um, as it is, I'm being gang stalked pretty hard as a person who serves the light. So um, if your world is going to go to hand, is going to crumble, more than likely it will. That's just where we are at this and this uh, game of gang stalking that is out here, you know, raping the, pu the public at large with their squatting of liberties. So while you got those liberty squatters out there hoeing out ethics, being a prostitute with clothes on, um, just know that whenever it's restored to you, it's restored to you and get God's grace, like tenfold. But between now and then, it's going to get pretty dicey. Uh, how do I know? Because I'm walking this walk. <laughs> I've always been ethical in all of my practices. Haven't been perfect in all of my practices. But I have been ethical in all of it. So uh, for y'all called to serve, the light hang. It's going, probably going to get worse before it gets better, but it's okay. Just know at the end of this road, you will be exalted and venerated as will I. And everybody who is uh, called to serve God, and we got to hold out the olive branch for the wicked that decide to serve the light too. So just know, it's, just know that you will have your comeuppance too.